What's going on guys, Sir Slash here, welcome back to another video, and today, today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a 2x2 two two modern house in Minecraft. This design is made by Smither Boss. go check him out, and I tweaked his design a little bit to make it, you know, a little bit better. Anyway, let's get on with the video. So what you want to do is you want to find a nice 2x2 two two area. So basically, let's say this is a good area, 2x2, two two, cobblestone, cobblestone. Obviously, this is going to be your base block, so don't really worry about this. You want to destroy this one, the one facing bottom left to you. Place two like that, and then place a lantern right on top. Now what you want to do is you want to get uh, some black stained glass, specifically three, and right across from it, one, two, three, get this. Now you want to do some cyan terracotta, place two up, Place quartz slabs like these, and then place a carpet like this. Just like Smither Boss says, it adds a nice bit of volume if you add white carpet. Now what you want to do is, right next to the the lantern, yeah, that's what it's called, you want to get some dirt. Some dirt, or a grass block. Now what you want to do is, you want to get a hoe, because you want to till the land. Yes, now you want to get some seeds. I'm actually going to do some normal seeds, and as you can see, it's watered, but we want it to grow a little bit faster, so this is how it's going to work. You're going to get some trap doors to go in and out of your house, you know, for convenience, and now this side is going to be where all your stuff is, so you want this side to have your trap doors so you don't really get in the way of your stuff. Let's just put that back there. So, you want one, two, three, four, five. Dig five down. Then you want to place some birch trap doors right here and right here. Make sure it's only three because you really only need three. Now, once you added three, you want to place water right next to, you know, the tilled land. So, let's get some water right here and then place it right here. By Minecraft physics or laws, this is should not fall down now what you want to do is you want to get a really nice furnace going on so delete the block under and add a c and add a furnace very simple now destroy these blocks destroy all the way down to the level you just dig now what you want to do is you want to remove that block add a nice crafting table because you need one of those those are very important to survival add some quartz slabs okay now this is a, a weird part Add two quartz slabs right there. One quartz slabs right there. Get some stairs. Okay, you want some stairs, some nice stairs. Place it right there. You want to get a torch. You want a night lamp, guys. Night lamps are always very useful. So get the torch. Place that right there. And you need a to place a bed. Now what I like to do is I just like going right here. And then, bada bing bada boom, you got that. So once you place that, you want to destroy this block and this slab. You want to get some chests, place that right there, and this and this. Make sure you pay attention, you can still open this. Make sure you press shift, and then walk over it. If you walked over it normally, you wouldn't be able to go. Press shift, then you can go. But, you can't go in like this, you just have to press shift. Now, of course, that might get annoying sometimes, but you get a double chest full of area, and I think that's actually really cool, because you can do some really nice stuff. You can ho hold torches, all trash items. I'm the kind of guy who dumps all their items in a chest. So now what you want to do is, once you have all this stuff going on, you can obviously make some walls, you know, make the whole place fancy enough for your taste. I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to replace everything with dirt. I'm a, I'm a simple type of guy, because stone and diorite don't look the best. So let's just have this, jump up, and to get up, all you want to do is get your crosshair on the brown spot, jump, and right click. If that doesn't work, you could just, you know, do this, this, and this. They might This might be hard for some mobile players. I actually find it the easiest on controller or mouse. Mouse is very good. I just find it very you know, nice to flick. Obviously, since you have water right here, this will cause the seeds to start growing faster. It's already growing pretty fast. Now, you have right under here a furnace and a crafting table. So if you're, if you're in a hurry, you can just be like, okay, let's just close this. Let's pretend a zombie's chasing me. Let's be like, oh my gosh, I need to craft a sword. Okay, uh... Uh, did, did you get get my iron, blah, blah, blah. Okay, craft, craft, craft. Watch out, watch out. You can do, you know, amazing sound effects way better than mine. And you got the zombie off. This is a very fun design made by Smither Boss, of course. Thank you. But this is a very fun design because it 
looks cool, it looks portable, and most of all, it's modern, so, um, uh, it's very easy to build, it's modern, so it looks cool, so when someone says it, there's like, oh, that's simple, and it's, it looks cool modern, so anyway, basically, that's the how to make a modern, t uh, two by two modern house made by Smitherboss, go check him out, I actually watch his channel a lot lately, since I found his two by two houses, and if you know my channel, I love making small houses, so I just love his channel, anyway, leave a like if you enjoyed this video, subscribe if you really enjoyed it, hit that notification bell, so every time I make a video, you will be notified, anyway, See you guys later. Bye!